But big data is our ability to use uh, vastly more data points than ever before and analyze them and gain insights from it. It differentiates itself from data analytics because with data analytics we took the data we already collected and took a look at it, analyzed it. But big data is very different. Big data just does not focus on a small sample of data, a small sliver of data, uh, the amount of data that we currently use. But it really tries to capture everything, everything about a question that we want to answer, everything about a phenomenon that we want to study. It tries to capture everything and then analyze it. So in relative as well as in absolute terms, it usually is a lot more data points than ever before. And that needs, it leads to a lot more insights. So the beauty of big data is that unlike the industrial revolution in manufacturing, uh, where you required uh, a factory in order to uh, play an important role, uh, you can uh, start using big data uh, almost without uh, huge uh, initial investments using cloud storage and analytics capabilities. Uh, and that means that big data is for SMEs, it's for startups, just as much as it is for large data companies. The short answer is no. Uh, I think we need uh, more and better data analytics skills. Uh, most of the data analysts today are focused on small data, analyzing uh, the limited amount of data that we have and squeezing every drop of value out of them. In the big data age, we have so much more data uh, that we need different tools. We need a different kind of expertise in order to tease out uh, the hidden nuggets of gold and insights that are there. I think that in the future, we'll see uh, big data experts to be uh, data analyst statistics uh, is a very important element to it. Uh, scraping data, scraping skills is very important. Uh, so a little bit of scripting and computer language understanding uh, is going to be important. Then, of course, we need a foundation of uh, uh, data visualization as well as of data ethics, the ethics of using data in an appropriate sense. Singapore uh, is in a fortunate position that it has a well-educated population uh, that it is relatively affluent, that it has good infrastructure in place, uh, and that it gives it good uh, prerequisites to do very well in the big data age. However, even with all the prerequisites in place, um, one must not be complacent, uh, because the most important element of being successful in big data is to have the right mindset to understand uh, what value data holds, and that needs to be instilled in the people.